Okay, nothing left to fear had work done with Slash. Yes, Slash, the awesome guitarist from Guns N' Roses. But this takes probably one of the most time-worn traditions of, ready for this, we're sitting now, a pastor and his family moved to a remote town. The remote town has some sort of bizarre supernatural occurrences going on. I know, people moving to new location, weird supernatural phenomena, that's like its own genre in the, in the horror films. This may have a pastor, he's got a family with him. You know, the, the moving is nice, but you get that small sinister feel. They throw a little bits and pieces here and there. I mean, you, you know the majority of the plot. You've seen one or two of these films, you know the overall transition of it. But they use the right amount of special effects. They don't overdo any effect, they don't underdo any effect, they do just enough to keep it interesting. Using some computer generated, using some practical. You know, it took a concept that's done so many times. Threw in a little bit here and there to make it feel a little bit fresher. Got some pretty decent acting, decent for low budget horror film. So if you got also had Anne Hitch, which is weird to see an actual named star in some of this, some of these movies. But she did a pretty good job. You know, she got a concept that's more than done a little bit more originally with some pretty decent acting and some pretty good special effects thrown in there, which actually makes for a pretty solid film. 